Hello, this is Drew the Driver with Riding to Cash. I just wanted to uh, talk about the, the scooter pilot program, the bird scooter pilot program that uh, I recently caught an email about and I followed through with. Essentially, it was a request for people to sign up to be part of this program and the program involved scooters that you captured on a certain day, you hold on to it for two days and then release it on a su uh, Saturday morning by 7 a.m. and then you get an extra two dollars per scooter that you did this for and in the email it was talking about leaving them plugged in at all times uh, but I actually have come to realize that it's more about keeping the scooters held in your home and then releasing them with a hundred percent charge that Saturday and I know that now because they sent another message after I followed through with doing 14 scooters that way and this new message was for today, which is Sunday the 20th, uh, you all the scooters you capture, you hold on to it through till next Saturday, they, this coming Saturday, which means it wants you to hold it for five days and it will pay you an extra $5 per scooter. So it looks like Bird has started to ask people to hold on to scooters uh, and they're paying out a dollar per day per scooter held for that time period. And as long as you follow through with it, they'll pay you the bonus. And it says within five business days. So the time at which they'll pay you out that bonus is getting longer and longer. Because originally it was like, oh, the following Monday. Now it's like up to five business days. So, or up to uh, a week, basically. So uh, this new program, um, it seems as if they're doing this to just keep scooters off the street during the week. Because maybe there's a higher chance of them being stolen or people are when it goes it's used like two times and then it gets captured that night to be uh, charged and the it just keeps happening over and over five days a week and it's it's like costing them more money to have it on the street than it is to have it held in someone's house so because scooters are mostly used on the weekends especially during cold times not as many people are willing to just jump on a scooter and drive around except on the weekend when they're playing so it's a higher likelihood of that happening for the weekend i i just skipped uh, i'm mostly just speculating as to why they're doing it but ultimately if you're someone who is willing to hold on to a scooter for long periods of time uh not charge it the whole time because that would be a waste of electricity not that much of a waste but it would be uh then check your email if you're a bird scooter charger check your email because you might have a request to see if you want to be a part of it. I got accepted um, probably because I have a pretty good track record. I've never been marked for any kind of warning or issue as a scooter charger and uh, I've been lucky enough to avoid all those traps of people taking a bunch of scooters waiting at their house several hours then capturing them late when the price goes up. That's in a, f a form of hoarding uh, and against the rules. Uh, I haven't broken that rule, luckily. But, uh, and I haven't been caught with anything else, any other problems. So, my account's clean, and I was accepted. So, I'm going to probably try it again. Try to capture at least another 14, 15 scooters, and just hold on to them. Make the extra five bucks. It does delay your payment for the first, for the, or, like, original cost, until Saturday when you release them. But, that's not a big deal. So, maybe I grab as many as I can, which will not be easy. They're pretty hard to find uh, scooters at night nowadays, especially with this incentive. But maybe I'm lucky I can grab like 20. So I'll hold on to those and release them next Saturday. And even though they're in your app as, excuse me, uh, in your app as uh, scooters that are um, overdue, uh, it says it will not stop you from being able to capture more scooters for the next day and the following day. So that's kind of nice. Um, but yeah, I'm going to try that out, and that is what the second message from Bird was. First one was saying the opportunity for the two-day thing, which could have been because it was raining in San Diego at that time, too. I don't know. And then the second one is this one for a whole week. So that's what I'm going to be doing. Uh, check your email. Maybe you have it, too. And if you know a specific reason why they're doing this, send a message or write a comment uh, because I'm curious. And if you like this video and, or my other content, uh, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and share with your friends. Thank you so much. And uh, this is Drew the Driver, and I'll talk to you later. Have a great rest of your day.